Hello, Swing Surgeon people. This is DJ here. I got to, uh, sitting with me, uh, with me to my right, Mike Gullick, former NFL star and uh, host of ESPN's morning radio talk show, uh, Mike and Mike in the morning. Uh, just wanted to, you know, get your thoughts on the day. We're actually at the Monday after the Masters. That's uh, Hootie and the Blowfish's uh, charity event up here at Myrtle Beach. And Mike and I got paired together today. We had a good time. What a great day. It was it was phenomenal day. And what I've learned yet again uh, in golfing is one of these is. is I'm, I'm not good at golfing, but, but DJ helped me. He helped me. He got he got a big workout today with the whole team on his shoulders as he was carrying us uh, through the course. But what a, what a beautiful day and what a great course. It really was, you know. And, and, and I'll be honest with you guys, for a guy that used to have to knock people's heads off, I was very impressed with his swing and his action out there today. I feel if we, we had some time to work on this, we'd have ourselves a perfect little swing surgeon swing over here. He was very close. Here's the tough part about it, the difference in our sports. So in football... When you get frustrated or aggravated, you get mad and you hit, try and hit somebody even harder. Okay, That's my outlet, and it works really well. In golf, when I stink for a few shots and I try and, and, and I get frustrated, I can't get mad to hit anybody. It's not good golf course etiquette to hit somebody. So I have to find a way to kind of woosa and breathe easy and kind of calm down and get a good swing. And, oh. and sometimes you taught me a great a great way to, to aim my shot though. Yes. Instead of in my, my iron game, instead of looking at the flag and aim and pick a spot in front of me, I'm kind of like bowling. You know, exactly. instead of looking at the pins, but pick a spot, and that really helped. That, it that does. Was a good tip. And that's a tip we tell all of our all of our subscribers and everyone out there. Aiming can be one of the biggest factors because the setup if you're set up improperly, it's very difficult to. to golf ball do what you want to do or swing and get the ball to go where you want it to go and it's such a simple thing to pick that spot out and get and get parallel to it but uh you know we had a great day out there it's funny he was talking about hitting people harder when he got upset and i always thought back i was like you know at least in football when you get mad you hit somebody harder you get some satisfaction out of that typically i think when i've got an upset on the golf course and i try and hit the golf ball harder things just don't work out for yeah, me yeah <laughs> that's when it goes from bad to worse you, but it's kind of great you, you know? try and swing harder and, and bad things happen so dj <laughs> did a nice job of helping me adjust there and i have trouble you, you know in my sport 40 yards is distance it's a sprint and you stop so going 18 holes I kind of wear out on energy. What did you give me today to give me some energy? We got a little profusion Absolutely there, guys. Absolutely right. Berry flavor I had today. And I, we got good feedback yeah, here. Yeah. We got a, was, we got a, a, phenomenal. a supporter. Gave me, gave me a little jump, gave me the energy. Usually by about 13 or 14, I'm worn down. But I felt good. Yeah. I felt good. And uh, what, what helped, too, is the way DJ was playing. He kind of carried us through. So uh, we finished up pretty strong. I provided a little energy. Profuse provided. Yep. And, uh, and and just having a good time. We had a gr great group today. Again, we're out here on Monday after the Masters. And uh, I love doing this event every year. It raises a lot of money for charity. Mike, that's the reason why guys like him come in, take time out of their busy schedule. They did their morning show here th this morning, actually live from the event. And uh, uh, and it means so much when these guys come out and do this kind of stuff. So from, from all of us here Monday after the Masters to all our swing surgeon people, Mike, thank you. And uh, we'll come back to you guys uh, real soon with another uh, little video blog.